Good morning, guys. It's Laurie from Passionate Penny Pincher, and I'm super excited because I have a huge secret to share with you guys today that we have been working on for the last month, and I am so excited and think you are gonna absolutely love it. Um, I also have a couple tips about um, some crock pot things that is, are gonna totally change your life, and my dog just decided to totally go nuts over here in the corner, so sorry about that. Anyways, okay, so lots of fun tips today, a huge secret that I can't wait to share with you guys, so let's come on over here. I'm gonna turn around real fast. Good morning, guys. How are y'all? I'm so excited you're on this morning. I'm so excited because something big is starting on Passionate Penny Pincher on Monday and you are going to be some of the first folks to hear about it. So good morning guys, share where you're from. I'd love to hear where you're at. Um, okay, so first up real quickly, I'm going to tell you that there are a ton of printable coupons. I just don't want to, I want to get this in before we talk everything else. This is the last day of um, September, so this is the last day you can print $100, hundreds of dollars in free printable coupons. They will all reset tonight at midnight. Um, so a couple good ones are $2 off Campers, 25 cents off Charmin, a uh, dollar off Kraft, 75 cents off Bacon, dollar off Philadelphia Cream Cheese, tons of coupons. I will give you the link to that in just a second. Now, let me tell you, y'all, I seriously have to stop my dog. He's totally out of control over here. Hang on. Stop it. Okay, come here, I'm sorry, guys. I can't believe my crazy dog is and that we give him a treat y'all i am so sorry how embarrassing crazy dog if y'all have a dog i swear it's like having kids you just kind of get you never know what we're gonna, we're gonna get into and i have my last treat there you go buddy okay okay so the dog is taken care of i am so sorry guys okay phew it's gonna be one of those mornings so guys today is the last day of september so that means october begins tomorrow and starting monday we are going to do a series that i think you guys are gonna love i think this may just change your slow cooking life so i'm going to tell you some secrets but starting monday i'm so excited we are doing passionate penny pinchers crocktober we are going to do 20 days of slow cooker meals 20 days of slow cooker meals Guys, we're gonna have a PDF, we're gonna have grocery lists, we're gonna have all your recipes, and every morning at 8.40 in the morning, I'm gonna make a recipe for you to tell you exactly how to do it. So we're gonna hand you it all. I don't even have the copy yet because we are still finalizing it, but we are gonna send it out to all of our email subscribers tomorrow so you will have the grocery list and everything you need right there. It's gonna change your life. And the best part, the thing I'm most excited about is um, last night I tested out a couple recipes because they were ones I hadn't done images for. Guys, first of all, it was the best and yummiest dinner we have had in ages. And when I was going through the grocery list, there were tons of cream of chicken soup recipes because that's kind of what we have. And so I thought, you know, as I was making out the list to share with you guys, I thought, what can we do to make this a little bit better? And I looked up some recipes for homemade cream of chicken soups, and they actually worked. Our dinner was fantastic. Our house smelled yummy. So I'm super excited because you're going to have fantastic dinner all month long in October. I'm going to have a fantastic dinner. It's going to be easy. I'm going to give you a grocery list. Like I said, every morning at 840, Monday through Friday, I'll be here live telling you all about it. Um, you can sign up, and we are going to send that out to our email subscribers. We're going to send you all guys the PDF tomorrow as soon as it's totally done and then we are going to um give you lots more information so okay i am so excited about crocktober y'all i can't can y'all just tell me can you just have a little joy here with me because it's we're all gonna have dinner for a whole month guys and i've got the grocery list for you you're gonna love it okay so today what i want to tell you about are and i would love for you to share this with folks guys if you don't mind to share this with anybody who wants to save on or who wants to maybe just make their life easier Today we are talking about ways to make homemade seasoning packets because I don't want you to feel like crock pot recipes are horrible for you. As many of y'all know, my husband's had a heart attack. Gosh, it's been almost six months ago. He has lost 40 pounds. He is doing amazing, but we are really trying to figure out ways to eat well um, and still do things that we love. Now my kids, they love cream of chicken. They love chicken and dumplings. I cannot make the chick biscuits perfect, but at least I can get rid of the cream of chicken soup. So I'm going to tell you today how to get rid of cream of chicken soup. I'm going to tell you, or I'm sorry, yeah, how to get rid of cream of chicken soup, how to make homemade seasoning packets so that you don't have to use all the junk. So I'm going to look at your comments. Yeah, I am so excited, guys. It's going to be a great month. Okay, so let's first show you, I'm going to show you how to make homemade cream of chicken soup. And if you sign up for those daily emails, I'm going to send all of this to your inbox and you will never, the best part about this is you're also going to spend less money. And we all like spending less money because cream of chicken soup is expensive. So it's bad for you and it's expensive. So how can we make it at home? Let's show you. It is super easy. First, you're going to use, y'all see that? You need um, dry milk. Now, I found this, I think, I would say look for it kind of like near flour and stuff. And you may have to ask your store. I do not often buy um, 
this, so it was something new for me to have to grab. Um, so, okay, so you're gonna use two cups of non-fat dry milk. You're gonna be so excited about how easy this is. Let's see. Which two cups ends up being about this container. Okay, so we're gonna use two cups non-fat dry mix. Then we're gonna add in three quarter cups of corn starch. So this is just corn starch, so super easy. starch. You're going to add in one quarter cup of instant bouillon granules. Now I'm going to tell you about these really fast. You have two options here. You can leave this out if you prefer not to use the bouillon gran granules, which is totally fine. And then you can add in chicken broth at the end instead of water. But um, the, just to make life easy today, you want to look for uh, low sodium chicken broth. So these are just the granules, that's the powder, and you're going to use a, a quarter cup of this. Okay, and then we're going to use a teaspoon of onion powder. I must have opened the wrong one. This one's not open. This one. Let's see. A teaspoon of onion powder. A teaspoon of basil. And a half teaspoon pepper. Okay, so y'all can you, here's my, y'all see this? Okay, so here are all of my um, ingredients and I literally just am mixing them together. Now this is what's awesome guys. All you're gonna do, ah, hopefully you won't make a mess like I just did, hopefully. Y'all are a little tidier than I am this morning. Um, okay, so you're gonna mix this all together. Sorry. And then once you're done mixing it, you are gonna put it in a plastic bag and you're gonna keep it in that plastic bag until you need cream of chicken soup. When you need cream of chicken soup, all you're gonna do is you're gonna add, remember how much, you're gonna to mix together a third cup of this dry mix as well as one and a quarter cups water and that's gonna equal one can of cream of chicken soup and you don't have to use the cream of chicken soup. So I think that is the most exciting thing. I'm gonna read your comments real fast and I will, re I will definitely, um, Elise, I saw you said to ask, post the recipe. I'm going to try to get it posted to, later today on Passionate Penny Pincher, but it is already in the PDF email. So if you will sign up for emails, I'm going to send you this recipe and lots more. Okay, so the next recipe we're going to make is for homemade taco seasoning. So this is another one that all the time, I never buy it because I'm just frugal. So this is the recipe that I use. So I use two teaspoons of chili powder. Oops. Okay, so we're gonna do two teaspoons of chili powder. A half teaspoon of salt. A half teaspoon of garlic powder. A half teaspoon of cumin. which honestly, I don't even, I actually just bought cumin to show you guys how I do it. You can do it without the cumin. I've done a lot without the cumin when I haven't had it. Um, a quarter teaspoon pepper. Um, one and a half teaspoons paprika. of onion powder, a pinch of red pepper flakes, which I, oh well here, let's see. And that's it. And so totally, look, there we have, so that's homemade Mexican um, taco seasoning. So I didn't have to buy it, I can make it myself, I get to know what the ingredients are, I love that. So I know a lot of slow cooker recipes, we all kind of freak out because They've got so many packaged things. So I will be sharing with y'all the t packets for things, but I'm also gonna show you how to make these. So we are also gonna make today, now we've got that one done. The last one I'm gonna make is, there are, well, I'll make this one super fast. Let's see, this is, oh, 
all my dry ranch seasoning. So it's the same kind of concept and I'll tell you it's super fast. Let's see, you're gonna do three quarter cup, three quarter teaspoon of black pepper. I lost my other spoon, guys. There it is, okay. Three quarters teaspoon of black pepper. A teaspoon of seasoning salt, which I forgot to grab. And guys, I got this at Aldi, super, super cheap for seasoning salt. I think I paid like a couple dollars for this and it's huge. Um, let's see. I'm gonna do a teaspoon of seasoning salt. A teaspoon of parsley, which I don't have, so I'm gonna leave it out. I never ever add parsley really to anything um, because I'm cheap and it's just one more thing that I always use. Um, a, a half teaspoon garlic powder and a half teaspoon onion powder. And once again, there it is. There's your dry ranch seasoning packet. And you don't have to, like, you don't have to do everything else. So, guys, sign up for emails because we're going to start, like I said, this is how it's going to work. And I'm going to try to read through your questions super fast. Um, it's hard to see. Okay. So, okay. So here's how everything's going to work starting Monday with Croctober. Let me show y'all. I just got a new crock pot yesterday. I'm so excited. It worked yesterday pretty well. Super excited. Isn't it cute? Um, so, um... And the reason I got that was my other one, Mrs. Potts, was getting in really bad shape. So I guess this is replacing my old Mrs. Potts for Ms. new Mrs. Potts because she was having, she was looking bad. Anyway, so what we're going to do starting Monday is every Monday morning at 840, I will um, make a recipe on live video. So y'all can watch that. You can also sign up and we're going to give you literally, I'm gonna, I will show it to you. I'm so excited. I'm going to email it out to all of you email subscribers. Tomorrow it is going to have your entire grocery list all of the recipes for the entire month. We will make five crock pot recipes Monday through Friday here live. The recipes will be as healthy as I can make them because I definitely wouldn't be eating healthier too. Um, they're all super, super simple. We're talking easy, easy recipes. Um, and then we will post the recipe on Passionate Penny Pincher at noon each day. And we will give you Austin, I'll do a quick picture in the evening. And if I can, I'll go ahead and do a quick live video of it in the evening so you can see what it looks like. So share this with your friends. If you know someone who would love to save um, by just cooking at home, this is the way to start. So I'm super excited. I hope that this will be something that will help make your October easier. I'm so excited and I'm so glad that y'all are joining me today. Let me know what you think. Let me know your comments. Definitely share with someone if they can help. And guys, sign up for this email so I can send you this. You're going to be so excited. Guys, the ebook is gorgeous and it's totally free right now, only for email subscribers. So talk to you soon. Have a fantastic day. Watch for lots of other good deals here on Passionate Penny Pincher and I'll read through your comments in a second and try to reply to you. Have a great morning. See ya.